As a new day dawns on the Atlantic coast, the sun reveals a town that is classically New England in almost every way. This is a seafaring town, and signs of it are everywhere. But one iconic image stands out among the rest. It's called Motif No. 1. Built in the 1840s to house fishing gear, its unusual name comes from a frustrated local art teacher. Many of the students would use the motif as a subject. He would see that building in their work over and over again and to the point where one day a student brought it in and uh, he said, oh, motif number one again. The name stuck and it's remained popular with artists ever since. Artists liked it because it was simple to paint, simple to sketch. Over time, it became emblematic of fishing towns all over New England. Yet even this enduring symbol could not withstand the elements forever. The infamous blizzard of 1978 blanketed the town in almost three feet of snow, pounded the region with hurricane force winds, and left motif number one in ruins. But New Englanders are nothing if not resilient and resourceful. They reconstructed motif number one later that year using some unusual ingredients. They put crankcase oil into the paint to make it uh, flat. And so when it was painted, it actually looked worn already and to this day they continue doing that. For the hardy New Englanders who make their living from the sea, motif number one stands as a testament to their proud maritime heritage. So, where in the world are you? You're in the town of Rockport, Massachusetts. <laughs>